are aware of it or not, everyone is controlling matter all the time. Whether one wants to be a demonstrator or not, he is. It is impossible to not be a creator all the time. Everyone is creating every day. We're not aware of it because we just don't look at it. Every thought, every single thought materializes in the physical world. It's impossible to have a thought that will not materialize, except that we reverse it. If we say the opposite, right after we have a thought with equal strength, we just neutralize it. But any thought not reversed or re neutralized will materialize in the future, if not immediately. So this thing of demonstration that we're all trying so hard to do, we're doing all the time. Unaware of the fact that we're doing it. All we need to do is to consciously direct it. And that we call demonstration. Everything that everyone has in life is a demonstration. It couldn't come into your experience had you not had a thought of it at some time prior. If you want to know what your sum total thinkingness is, it's exactly determined what's around you, what you have. That's your demonstration. If you like it, you may hold it. If you don't, start changing your thinking. Concentrate it in the direction that you really want. Until those thoughts become predominant, and whatever those thoughts are, will materialize in the world. And when you begin to demonstrate consciously small things, you may then realize that the only reason why they're small is because you don't dare to think big. That the exact same rule or principle applies to demonstrating a penny that applies to demonstrating a billion dollars. The mind sets the size. Anyone who can demonstrate a dollar can demonstrate a million dollars. Businessmen. Become aware of the way you're demonstrating the one dollar bill. And just put six zeros after it next time. Sit on the consciousness of the million rather than the dollar bill. This relates to what I have been saying, that there's no difference between the spiritual and the material when you see it. The material being just a out-projecting of our minds into what we call the universe and the world and many bodies. And when we see that it's just an out, project, an out projecting of our mind, it's just a picture out there that we have created, we can very easily change it instantly.
So to repeat, everyone is demonstrating, creating, every moment that he or she is thinking. You have no choice. You are a creator. So long as you have a mind and think. To get beyond creation, we must go beyond the mind. And just behind the mind is the realm of all knowingness, where there's no need for creation. There's a higher state than creation. It's a state of isness, of beingness, sometimes called awareness, beingness, consciousness. That's just behind the mind. That's beyond creation. The mind finds it very difficult to imagine what, what it's like beyond creation because the mind is involved primarily in creation, in creating. It's the creating instrument of the universe and everything that happens in the world, in the universe. So if you take this thing called mind, which is only a creator, and try to imagine what it is like beyond creation, it's impossible. The mind will never know God, because you have to go just above the mind to know God, to know the infinite being that we are, to know what it's like beyond creation. The final state is beyond creation. The ultimate state is the changeless state. In creation, everything is constantly changing. Therefore, in creation, the ultimate truth is not there. So, to demonstrate what one wants, one needs to become aware of the fact that all we need to do is to think only of the things we want. And that is all that we would get we would do just that. Only think of the things you want, and that's what you'll be getting all the time. Because the mind is only creative. Nice and easy, isn't it? Also, take credit for all the things you create that you don't like. Just say, oh, look what I did. Because when you become aware that you've created things you don't like, you're still in a position of creator. And if you don't like it at all, you have to do is turn it upside down and you'll like it.